my channel Magnolia Budgets or if you're new, hello, welcome. I am so glad to have you here today. We do all things cash, stuffing, budget, planning, saving challenges, and honestly just all things dealing with money and of course we come here to chat. So you guys, today we're going to be stuffing my cash envelopes and sinking funds. So let's go ahead and count and see how much money we're going to be stuffing today. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So 130, 31, 32, 33. So 133 dollars is what we're gonna be stuffing today. So let's go ahead and get the money on the cash tray. Y'all, sorry if y'all hear my dog like coughing or whatever. I don't know. She has like this cough. I don't know if it's allergies or what, but she just started it today. So sorry if y'all hear her in the background doing that. Like this is her second time doing that before. Like I think she did it two years ago one time. So I don't know if it's like allergies because I know the season is changing. I don't know if she went outside and you know something got in her throat or her nose. I'm not really sure. So we are like monitoring her to make sure she's okay but nonetheless let's let's go ahead and get right into the cash stuffing okay so between today's video and friday's video we're going to be stuffing a total of 262 dollars let's go ahead into my cash wallet this is the pink ostrich wallet it's a seven size we also have purple i think we have two purple left and i want to say like three i think three or four pink so y'all are really buying these and I'm so thankful and grateful. Um, let me know if I should restock them or not. I know I wasn't able to get my hands on a lot of other colors. I was able to get white but those sold out. So let me know if I should bring back these because I feel like they're going to be sold out here soon. Alright and I just absolutely love them. It's so super cute and... You can get just the wallet or you can get the wallet and the cash envelope. So it's completely up to you. All right, so I was on the wrong page. <laughs> Nonetheless, it's still the same um, for the amount and everything. So this is the one that we should be on. So for self-care, we're gonna go ahead and step $20. So I will be needing to get my nails done soon, 20, 40, 60. So we have $60 in self-care um because soon i will be going to a concert and i am going to need my nails done so i'm super excited about it miscellaneous is not going to get anything and it is empty so we have zero in there my fur babies are going to get ten dollars and so um i am going to get my hair done as well i think my hair is going to be a total of 260 and I'm going to try quick weave. So this is going to be my first time, y'all, trying to quick weave. Definitely leave a comment down below if you wear those, um, that kind of style. This is be my very first time. I have had a sew-in before, um, but I've only had a sew-in once. And, of course, I've had braids and whatnot. I'm not, I don't really wear a whole lot of weave. Um, I usually just wear my natural hair. But from time to time, like for vacations and stuff like that, I do tend to try to have in a protective style um but like on a day-to-day -day, i just wear my regular hair but i do want to do a quick weave because like i said i am going to be going to a concert um so i'm super excited about it so my favorite base has 20 40 60 80 120 30 35 40 so 140 so they have a really good amount in there it's really adding up so, all right. This week for groceries, we have already went grocery shopping. I think we spent $122. So we actually went over, but we did need to get like some personal items. Like my fiance, he needed to get body wash and shampoo. And I had to get um, some more Panoxyl and stuff like that. So this is what we have left over from last week. So 10, 15, 16, 17, 18. And I'm going to add in 50, 20, 40 and 50 but i'm actually going to add it to the back because it's going to go back to bank because we spent all the money so we have no leftover money for this week like i said we actually went over which i already knew what we we're going to do also fetch had some really really good deals this week you guys so i'm not sure if y'all still scan your receipts into fetch 
or if you don't know what fetch is i do have my link down below my referral link um in the description box so definitely go check it out i highly recommend it is legit and so it's pretty much an app. You will download the app to your phone and you just scan in your receipts for points. And they have like these little deals that you can do to get more points. So for example, I think it was, I think it might have been like the smart food popcorn. I'm just going to do an example. If you spent, I'm going to say $15, then you would get like 2,000 points. Um, I know some people have like the Starbucks one, like I wish I had that one because I love Starbucks. My mom literally was just getting points after points after points. I mean, her points were just racking up on Fetch. I was even giving her my receipts because I was like, you you might as well get those points versus me getting 25. I think she had got like 350. She had got over, I think she got at least a thousand one time. So definitely check out Fetch. It's completely free. All you do is scan in your receipts and you can get points and you exchange your points into free gift cards i've already gotten multiple free gift cards from there and i'm about to get another one so i'm super excited about it all right so gas is gonna get eight dollars i also did the chester's um deal that they had i think i had to i think it was like 500 points each and so I think I ended up buying two things so I got a thousand points so 510 let's see I need three more dollars 5 10 11 12 13 so I have 13 in gas so I am trying to save a little bit of money here in gas um because my fiance birthday is coming up so I want to make sure I do have a little bit of extra gas money Shopping is empty. Starbucks, we have some gift cards, date night, and then money going back to the bank. And that is it for my cash wallet. Let's go ahead on into seeking funds. If you are interested in this binder, which is so super cute, it is our clear pastel PVC binder. It's so super cute. Um, you can get it with envelopes. You probably can get it without the envelopes if you just want the binder as well i think i have that option on there i have the tired of being penniless dashboard and i also have my cow keychain on here which is actually a freebie depending upon how much you spend sometimes i'll throw them in with orders so we have a couple different colors in the binders we also we have pink purple and white so definitely go check out the website so vacation is going to get thirty dollars So we're trying to rack up some more money for vacation. Got a vacation, y'all. We only live once. And, you know, I was just listening to some lives. And um, I think it was Real Talk with Kim. Uh, y'all, I'm in my build a relationship with Jesus era. Like, be in my Bible era. My bag, my Bible, and about my business era. So... <laughs> Um, she was just like, make Jesus, you know, the center of your life and be mindful, which I hear a lot of people say, be mindful about like what you say and what you think and try to determine like what is the devil and what's coming from like God. So it's like, sometimes we can have these negative thoughts you know, where I'm never going to be good enough. I'm never going to get a raise. I'm never going to get a promotion. I'll never be able to afford that house, that car. Um, I'm never going to have children or, um, you know, my YouTube channel is never going to grow. I'll never be a stay at home mom or I'll never be making six figures. You know, whatever we have that mindset and that's just the devil. And so try to, you know, actually listen to what is going on like what's being said in your mind and realize that those negative thoughts are the devil if it's not positive then it's the devil because god wouldn't put negative thoughts in your head and so i just really love that like make you know make god make jesus the center of everything of everything you know when you're worried pray when you're stressed, pray. 
when you don't know what to do, just pray. Jesus will comfort you and be there for you. And you may not feel like he's like you're not getting any answers, but I feel like it's a relationship that you have to build and you have to be consistent and you'll just start to realize that these thoughts or things that you read or things that you hear are the answers that you prayed for. So I'm just, that's just what I am working on and that's just what I've been listening to. Y'all tell y'all listen to a lot of motivational things and it really just puts me into a better place. It's it's peaceful. I I, I want to be, I want to have peace in my life. Like I don't want to be angry. Like I choose joy. Like I just want to be happy. You know, whatever that means for me. Like I just want to be happy. I don't want to be angry. I don't want to be irritated. I don't want to be frustrated. I just want to be happy. I want to have peace in my home. Peace at my job. Peace when I go out in public with people. That's all I want. <laughs> like, is that too much to ask for? Like, is anybody else like that right now? All right, so vacation has 1, 2, 20, 40, 60, 80, 3, 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68. So, 368. So, yeah, that's currently me. Like, I may not read my Bible every day or tune into the, you know, the lives, but I do try to get some kind of motivation and I do pray every day. So let's see what's in savings. Savings still has $16. Just going to put that back in. All right. Car maintenance is going to get $5. So it's going to put five in there. So we have 20, 40, 45, 50, 55. My fiance actually sold his car. <laughs> Y'all, him and these cars, he, he's already had like four, three or four different vehicles. So I'm hoping that whatever he gets this time, he will be satisfied and happy with. I want him to just be content. <laughs> All right, so vacation. Let's see what's in there. 20, 40, 45, 50, 55. So we have 55 in there, which we could also use towards gas or towards um, my fiance's birthday dinner. So maybe I can try to stuff that here in the next couple of weeks. Just try to stuff, you know, maybe about 40, 40 to 60 dollars. So manifest is gonna get five, five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So we have 30 dollars going to manifest and at the end of the month or when I remember it will go through the manifestation finder month ahead I'm trying to get a month ahead on my bills but y'all know I will need about 1200 to get a month ahead on all my bills so we have 120 40 45 50 55 60 61 62 63 64 65 66 67 so we have 167 dollars a month ahead um, but I'm also working towards having two, 2,500, I think it'll be a little bit over, to, well, yeah, 2,500, I'm working towards $2,500 into my abundance fund, aka emergency fund, and so if anything happens, then I would, I am a month ahead on my bills, um, I'm thinking about putting my money into a high yield savings account, so I'm super excited about that. My friend, I had thought about it before uh, when everybody was talking about it, but I really couldn't figure it out. But my friend did let me know about a about an account with the bank that we bank at. So I'm super excited about it. I can't wait to look more into it. But I've also been doing my research on some other banks as well now that I kind of know what to look for. So 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. We have $45 in wedding and then zero and maybe Maggie and zero in water bill. I haven't gotten my water bill yet from my mom, so I'm not really sure how much my water bill is. So I will have to check in with her to see how much my bill is. All right. So besties, that is pretty much it for today's video. If you made it all the way to the end, leave a cow emoji down below in the comment section that will let me know that you have made it all the way to the end. 
But you guys, that is it for today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to your friends on my channel. So come over here, budget with us, chat with us a little bit. Go check out my website, magnoliabudgets.com. Go check out my Etsy shop as well. It is linked down below in the description box. I'm sure there's something over there that you will love. Thank you all so much for your continued support. I'm so thankful and grateful for you all, besties. And I will catch you guys in my next video. All right. Bye. Thank you.